stately yeah. home. <laughs> is, yeah. it, is, is it really as sort of sedate and genteel as, as they make out? Well, it, on first impressions, it probably is, because it's still beautifully laid out and a very fashionable town. So are the people. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> And it's always had a bad image, you know, in a way. Cheltenham is always, as you may, make, they make jokes about retired colonels and people in bath chairs and everything. It shouldn't really be, in a sense, it's probably not a bad image for the people who are actually enjoying it now, I suppose. No, I suppose not. But there's a lot of us, I mean, like myself, who came here many years ago and discovered what a lively place it is, actually. You know, what, the lot, town itself? The town is, you know, it's an industrial town with a lot of light industry. You know, there's Doughty's and Smith's, you know, they do aircraft industry and yeah. all that stuff. Yeah. Eagle Star Insurance, yes, Gulf Oil, Craft. Yes. There's government communications headquarters. Oh, yes, I passed that. That's sinister. Say no more. That's very that sinister in the middle of town, virtually, that's isn't right. it? So it doom watch stuff. That's it. Yes, well, that's so I was pleasantly right. surprised yeah. how much is going on here. Um, by 1982, I'd really grown to love this area very much, and not only Cheltenham, but the hills and the country around, because it is a very much a centre for the Cotswolds, and, and there's the River Severn, and the yeah. rest of Gloucestershire. And I'd come to appreciate what a literary heritage there is here and found some uh, poetry by Laurie Lee and Ivor Gurney and Leonard Clark and people like that. How, how long started... ago were they? Are those relatively contemporary poems? Um, well, Laurie Lee were, were write... was writing in the 1940s yeah. and Leonard Clark in the 50s and 60s. So well, what are you actually going to do for us today? Well, I'm going to sing a poem that I discovered in 1983 called This Night the Stars. It was written by Leonard Clark and it really celebrates the view of Birdlip Hill, which is just outside Cheltenham and Gloucester. I went there yesterday. Yes, it's, it's beautiful up there. There's a lovely yeah. viewing point and everything. And uh, it also celebrates the country all around that area and around Cheltenham. This night the stars like jewels shine High over Birdlip Hill And sevens bar to silvery line Smooth flowing at a will While all the lamps of Gloucester town Are twinkling and the moon beams down Upon these fields of mine How can this ever pass away This home of hills and trees Judgment Day, when all are on their knees, they'll find who through the clouds shall rise, that Gloucestershire is paradise, and heaven's fields are This night the stars like jewels shine High over Birdly Hill And sevens bar to silvery light Smooth flowing at the wind While all the lamps of Gloucester Town Are twinkling 